Hey guys, OB Cars Workshop. <clears throat> well, we did our uh, we did our next project here. It is a 1953 Chevy panel. Uh, panel, uh, guess what? It's, I guess you call it a panel wagon. <clears throat> it has no back windows or something like that in it. And um, pretty much built box stock. I had a few changes on it. I built it to the same color scheme that's on the uh, box. This was the box of the, the green car on it. The drag racer made by Ravel and yeah so I added uh, uh, rally wheels to it uh, just painted the interior red on it I left the same color scheme on the inside I didn't do a whole lot um, to just build a box stock which is kind of unusual for me <laughs> but I had some problems with my uh, airbrush it just wasn't um, spraying the way it should be and you're gonna see a bit of a, <clears throat> a change in the color if you see the red there if it you probably see it in the camp in the video it was kind of blood kind of this didn't spray correctly <clears throat> so it is the way it is time for new year brush so hoods kind of worked on this one i'm not too sure why but just is gonna hold it down make it look the part and yeah so i mean all in all it is a pretty good kit and a guy can do a whole bu a whole bunch of this kit and everyone has so Yep. I did lower the front end down a little bit, uh, just a hair. Nothing crazy. Um, I, I basically shaved off the front suspension a few millimeters to give it a little bit lower stance. I shortened the mufflers on it a little bit, and um, I see it come out too perfect. But anyway, it is the way it is. So um, let's show the engine. Engine is box stock you know good old big block Chevy of some sorts I guess I'm not too sure what kind of maybe 396 or something I don't know who knows I don't know some kind of engine yeah so there you have it so that's another project done and ready for the bench and this model here many guys have built it and many variations and it's a really good kit for doing custom pull out custom uh, tubbed out whatever you want it's a really good model for that and uh in true story real life i had one uh, many years ago and i bought it and i, was gonna, I had a big big plans and ideas for it and one guy come by one day and says i want to sell it I says yeah sure why not so basically a guy said oh here's a number I'm like okay <laughs> because I didn't pay very much the car the guy wanted to give me a few thousand dollars for it and I call it shit you know but in today's market with uh, old classic cars that car would have been worth a lot more money unrestored um, but um, I have a picture of it mm -hmm. well maybe someday I'll uh, show you guys a picture of that car but anyways anyways guys thanks for watching my video and um, stay tuned for more videos coming up. Bye for now.